Hi everybody, I have the best announcement for you today. So I have been asked by the amazing Crafty Meraki to be a part of her Meraki Scrapbooker Social, which will be May 4th. I'm super excited to be an instructor. If you are uh, have been around here for any amount of time, you know that I love to support small businesses that make amazing things. I love to incorporate all kinds of paper crafting products into my projects, including dies and stamps and smaller paper pads and all those kinds of goodies. And this uh, event was such a perfect fit for me and for my style that I immediately said yes. So Crafty Meraki is a small business. It is located in the United States, in Virginia. So geographically, it's close to me, which makes me super excited too. And the retreat, the event, the Meraki Scrapbooker Social is completely free. In the description box below, you will find a link to register and you can come and you can have the best time creating along with us completely free. We have some amazing, amazing instructors. Me, Jessica Michaels, and Inessa, which is paper and bling. Uh, for sure, the three of us are teaching, and um, I love those girls so much, so I'm super excited. Now, if you want to scrapbook along with us through this social, so the way that the workshops work are they are about 90 minutes each, and you can follow along completely with us and create all of our projects right along with us. If um, you, you can either shop your stash or you can drop by a retreat quick kit. Now the retreat kits are amazing. I'm gonna go through the retreat kit and the add-on bundle with you right now. Um, the most important thing to know is that in addition to this retreat kit, we will be pulling in things from our stash. So perfect. You get some new products. You get to pull a little from your stash. Perfect, perfect. Just the way I like it, right? Okay. So this is the retreat kit. And there will be a link to this kit in the description box below. Um, us as instructors will be sharing ideas. And one of our workshop layouts will feature just this kit. But there is an add-on. So the kit will include this six by eight paper pad, which is called Colored Cascade Pattern Paper. It's 12 patterns, two of each. So you get two of each pattern. They are double-sided papers. So you can see here, for those of you that it matters for, these are the glossy type of papers. You know I don't care. These are the same type of paper that I use for that Wild Whisper uses and Brutus Monroe and I, uh, I don't care. But if you care, just know these are the glossy papers. And look at these patterns. Oh, how gorgeous are these for spring and summer crafting. They are so pretty. Now imagine them die cut into different shapes. You can make letters out of them. Um, you can find so much inspiration on my channel for how to use six by eight paper pads because they're some of my absolute favorites. The next paper pad that is in the kit is the Retro Blooms paper pad. I've been through this kit a bunch of times as I was designing my layouts. So <laughs> yours probably will come uh, much in much better shape. I already tore the back off this one. So this is the Retro Blooms paper pad. Look at these colors. Um, I will be sharing a heritage layout with this specific paper pad because I think it is so perfect for that. It's super pretty. I love these. I love this paper especially. Look at that. So I'm just going to flick through all these different designs so you get a nice feel for uh, what will be both in the retreat or in the the event, what kinds of paper pads will be in the event, and what kinds of layouts you can uh, do. So you can see we have two different options, both beautiful, but very different. So you will find lots of inspiration for 
almost any kind of project you would like to do. The next thing that's part of the retreat kit is this affluent, affluent heart Meraki dies. So you have a set of one, two, three, four, five layered hearts, and then the cute little love you, which I think is adorable. Then, okay, so this is totally cool. This is something I've never, ever seen before that is included in this kit. And I think it's the neatest thing. Okay, so there is this paper pad called Effortlessly Artistry Paper Collection. This is the love like no other. So what this is, is it is a pad. Every page is the same. And it has um, these cute little flowers and they're colored in a variety of styles and designs. And then there are all of these sentiments that you can use. So everyone is the same. This would be great if you just want to batch make some really great cards. So cute. I love this idea. So in addition to this effortless artistry paper pad, there is the Love Like No Other die set. So these dies, there's a reason this is called effortless. These dies fit all this um, flowers, the flowers, and then it fits all of these sentiments. Ah, how cool is this, right? So it's done. You don't have to color. You don't have to, it, it's just going to, it's right there, ready to go. And this is big. Like this is not a little pad. So it would take you a long time to maybe get to a point where you would have, you, you would run out of paper. Um, so super simple. And then this is the cool part. There is this die. So this is the Love Like No Other Meraki Motifs. And what it is, is it is a layered die that creates those flowers. So even after maybe you get to a point where you use all of these, um, you can use the stencil set, go ahead and stencil up your flowers and cut them with the dies. For my projects, I will be using this um, at least for one because I think some of these would be perfect for scrapbook layout titles. So happy spring, love you, uh, spring wishes. You guys know how much I love to do heritage layouts. So there's this little grandma here that I feel like I could totally use for some things. Love like no other. I feel like that could be used as a scrapbook title. So, and these flowers would be gorgeous on either side of a photograph. So, Really, really love this little collection, and this is included in the kit. Uh, I know for sure I will be using these elements on my projects. Um, whether those projects will be in the workshop or if they will be extra, I'm not sure, but I am filming all of my videos. So you will, if you get the kit, you will have access if you're on my channel and subscribed you will have access to at the very least for the workshop and then two extra videos with the retreat kit so just know that that's that's an option so more there's so much in this kit you guys I'm trying really hard to go through this a little bit quick but we'll see okay so the next kit that's in the the next part of the main retreat kit is birthday star mini slimline uh it comes with a little sentiment it has these layered stars. So whether you like hearts or whether you like stars, we've got you covered for both those. And then we have these little, um, so these are layered and they may at first glance seem like they are, um, like card centric, let's say, but I don't see them as that way. I think they're going to be amazing. I think they would layer up behind a photo. Super pretty. I think that if you cut this smaller one a couple of times, you could like fan them out and they would be awesome and gorgeous. The next thing that is in this kit is the English Rose stencil set. So this is a layered stencil. There are three, three, one, two, three, three stencils in this kit and it creates this pretty large English Rose motif. 
Really super cute. You guys, I love layered stamps, layered stencils. You guys knew that. The last part that is part of this retreat kit is the Crafty Meraki Artisan Flora Dyes Wreath. So it is, the idea behind it is to create a wreath, right? But break it up. It will make each of these layered flowers. You guys know, ah, I am all about flowers. And then there is also a little leaf die. So you can make your own gorgeous floral colors in any color you want, any design you want. Does not have to be a wreath. wreath. You'll be set. So that is everything that is in the main retreat kit. Lots of options, lots of products. Um, I'm so excited to start cutting into this paper. Oh, forgot one more thing. There's also these little gems. These tiny, tiny little jewels. Look how pretty they are. There's a couple different sizes in here and it comes in this really nice little jar that I think is perfect and awesome. So that is the retreat kit. And you can find in the description, these are available for purchase right now when you see this video, they're live. I, in the down below, you can grab the retreat kit. You can grab a registration to the, to the event. You can come and join me for amazing workshops all day long, May 4th. If you want more product, there's more product too. So there is an add-on retreat kit, which we will also be using for our workshops. So um, there will be projects that just have the main retreat kit, but then there will also be projects that include the add-ons. Again, lots and lots of content for you with this event. So in the add-on kit, we have the Lily dies. Those are super pretty. So they'll cut the lily, but then they'll also emboss here and create these fun lilies. Then we have the laurel leaf, which I think is so amazing. I love dyes like this because I am a huge fan of tucking greenery into things on my scrapbook layouts, right? Um, so I think this is really pretty. I love that there are two sides. I love really simple dyes like this. They, they are my bread and butter. I adore them. Uh, the next one is called the Emma Meraki Flora Dyes. So you get three flower dyes and then you get all the greenery you need to make a little set of flowers. Look at how many dyes are in this. Crazy. There's a gorgeous butterfly, layered butterfly die. So you have the bottom piece and then you have the two pieces to layer on top and the butterfly's little body and his wings. And here's a look at what that butterfly looks like. This is called the Emperor Wings die. So pretty. Just for a second, I have to say this. Think about cutting some of those layers in glitter paper. I'll just leave that with you. Also, size-wise, this is a nice size for a scrapbooking embellishment. Then in the retreat kit are two more six by eight paper pads and they are gorgeous. This one is called For the Love of Flowers. I mean, who doesn't love flowers? I love that there are two sides to these papers. So you have one that's a little busier. It has all those florals, but then you also have some pretty solids that you can mix and match into your projects. Let's just flip through these real quick. And there are two of each, so perfect for scrapbooking. And then the second paper pad is called Lux Plaid Pattern Paper, which is just gorgeous, springy, summery, beautiful patterns that you can mix and match with your stash and use in so many different ways. I adore these. So those are both of the retreat kits. And then there is the big event, the Meraki Scrapbooker Social on May the 4th, where you will have workshops and different ideas. And um, if you purchase the kit and you're looking for more inspiration, I have them. I have both the kits. They're here in my stash. I will be pulling them out and using them, I am sure, 
through my spring and summer projects because these are gorgeous and I am so excited to play with them. And um, I don't like to have stash, so I will be trying my hardest to get these all killed off before September, <laughs> right? All right, so if you would like any more details, you can check them out in the description box below. There will be some information down there about early bird pricing and early bird extras that you get. If you uh, sign up before certain dates, uh, you get extra goodies in your packages. So that's amazing. And I will talk to you all again very soon. But right now, I need to go cut some paper. Bye.